Today's world is moving faster than ever before. Computers are more powerful than ever. You can connect with anyone in the world with the touch of a button, and artificial intelligence is being developed and perfected. As a result, our data is constantly being collected and stored. Top companies such as Facebook, Amazon, and Google are all using this big data every day. We are losing control of our personal information, and there's not much we can do about it. However, there are projects like Ethereum and its yearly developers conference that are finding solutions towards a more decentralized future. In general, blockchain is a new way of storing data so that it's unchangeable and not controlled by one company. Metaphorically, this is like individuals lining up with name tags that include their name and the person before and after them. If anyone moves out of line, is missing, or not supposed to be in line, it's easy to tell by reading everyone's name tag. Ethereum is a type of blockchain that allows this data to be integrated with computer logic for more complex tasks, and this is all discussed more in depth at the annual DevCon convention. This year's fifth annual DevCon convention was held in Osaka, Japan, and was focused on bringing developers, researchers, and more to collaborate together on their work and findings in the Ethereum and cryptocurrency space. DevCon is a, uh, a gathering of the community members of the Ethereum ecosystem and the broader uh, cryptocurrency and blockchain uh, ecosystem to get together to learn about the advancements that's happened over the last year, uh, since the prior DevCon, there's a lot of different projects going on within the ecosystem, and so this gives them an opportunity to pitch their advancements and their uh, um, new, uh, I guess, improvements, and, and allows the community to like get informed on what's going on and learn about the projects that they're interested in, uh, and also discover new ones that are coming up soon. Sandeep Nawal is one of these developers who attended this year's conference. As co-founder and COO of Matic Network, he explains why he believes Ethereum to be so beneficial to our future. Yeah, so I think, uh, you know, Ethereum is like a general purpose during complete, uh, you know, blockchain. So you can write a lot of different kind of uh, business logics and programmable money kind of use cases on this. And this is like, you know, this is like the, the, the next stage of the revolution that Bitcoin started. So those kind of fundamental aspects like, you know, decentralized uh, network, decentralized computation, uh, ownership and you know censorship resistance and all that these kind of features provide a very solid bedrock of uh, you know of, of, of a global kind of system in the global economy that we are moving as Sandeep described ethereum is a way to decentralize our network him and his company Matic are currently working on ways to scale ethereum and make it simpler to use so that anyone can use it without worrying about the complexity of the system Cooper Turley, Managing Director of Fitzner Blockchain Consulting, helps to better explain Ethereum and how Fitzner Blockchain Consulting helps people learn about and integrate blockchain. Ethereum is the most vibrant ecosystem in blockchain today. So whether that's decentralized financial applications or a new way to tokenize your business, Ethereum offers a one-stop shop and a go-to platform with a wide variety of developers building the next generation of internet services. One of the biggest problems with the industry today is it's too complicated, you know. The average person doesn't really know where to get involved. Somewhere like DEF CON is great because we can really go down the rabbit hole and discuss the bigger issues. But, you know, for me personally, I'm very curious about where the average individual comes into play. If you want to talk about making a native credit system or doing anything to help unlock your business to the next level, that's where we try and add value in the consulting business to help make sure that you can take your business to the next level and take advantage of some of the opportunities that this currency and this ecosystem offers. In addition to developers and community members collaborating, DevCon also hosts presentations, events, and other activities for people to get involved in during the convention. This makes it interesting for all types of people attending and assures that the community is welcoming for all. I think cryptocurrency and blockchain and, and this whole ecosystem is a very, uh, a very novel one, so there's a lot to be learned and a lot to still be done to, uh, to I guess, revolutionize the various industries that, that this will, a lot of us believe, uh, revolutionize one day. So if you're at all interested in learning it, 
Um, there's tons of open source uh, community, like re references and communities you can join. There's uh, communities all over the world, so check out your city, uh, and hopefully you'll be able to find a way in which to get involved and get involved in the community. For more information about DevCon, Ethereum, and how to get more involved, visit devcon.org.